Hi everyone, my name is Isaiah Chiron. I'm 13 years old, an eighth grader at Scott Highlands Middle School, and I play the oboe. This upcoming year will be my fourth year in Gitsies and my second year in symphony. I first heard about Gitsies from a mom whose daughter was in Philharmonic at the time. She told me that I had to audition for the upcoming year because her daughter loved the program. A few months later, my teacher finally convinced me to do an audition for the second trimester. Little did I know that one audition would give me amazing opportunities, help me meet new people, and give me experiences that I will remember for the rest of my life. When I was 10 years old, many thoughts ran through my head as I walked into the audition room. Like, will my judge laugh at my playing? Am I even good enough to get into an orchestra? I remember being even more nervous after hearing all of the experienced players playing their fast scales and their really hard music in the practice area. After I anxiously played through my audition, I remember a weight being lifted off my shoulders. A few weeks later, to my surprise, I got an email saying I was placed into Camerata. That was just the beginning. At my first rehearsal, I was greeted with a kind smile and a handshake from Miss Flooding. I remember walking with her into the rehearsal space, seeing kids much older than I was. At first, I thought no one would ever talk to me or even acknowledge that I was even there. But it was the total opposite. Everyone said hi to me and helped me along the way through the year. In the orchestra, I had many firsts, like taking my first audition, being part of an orchestra, and playing with the choir for the first time. But my highlight would have to be playing my first concert in orchestra hall. I remember walking into the concert hall, just being astonished and overwhelmed at how enormous and stunning the concert hall looked. It was also the first time I ever got to play Jupiter with all the other orchestras. It was such a magical experience to see everyone playing the chorale with so much passion. The first season sadly ended, but quickly I must say, the next year I auditioned again. I was elated to find out that I was placed in a concert orchestra. My time in concert orchestra with Mr. Gitch was very inspiring. That year, not only did we get to compose and arrange children's music and play at big concert venues, we also got to play for people in the community. One of my favorites was playing a Christmas concert at the Union Gospel Mission. It was a very cold and frigid night, but our music seemed to warm the hearts of all the people in that building. It was very inspiring to think that our music just made the day for the hundreds of people who attended the concert. It really showed me the power of music. Throughout the year, I met new people and learned new things. But again, that season two ended. The next year, I was extremely happy to find out that I got, I got placed in symphony. Symphony was always the orchestra that I looked up to. Everyone in the orchestra played at such a high and mature level that I looked forward to hearing their music at every festival. Last year was the first time I got to play a whole symphony. We played Tchaikovsky's Sixth Symphony, and to be honest, it was an emotionally and physically exhausting piece, but probably one of the most rewarding experiences for me at Gitsis. Last year in symphony, throughout the year, we had the amazing opportunity to play with and be mentored by musicians from the University of Minnesota Symphony Orchestra, the Minnesota Orchestra, and the St. Paul Chamber Orchestra. It was so cool to see every musician play in their own style and show us their passion for music. Their feedback was very helpful and shed light on new ideas that I had never thought of before. Along with learning about composers and their music, Maestro Smith also introduces us to new words that I've never heard before. At every rehearsal, he gives us a word of the week. Even though I may not know what most of them mean, my teachers at school were quite impressed that words like picaresque, opprobrious, and evanescent even came out of my mouth. <laughs> this year in symphony, I'm looking forward to working with Maestro Smith, playing Brahms I, and of course going on tour to southern Italy. So far in Gitsies, I've gone through an amazing musical and personal journey. This year, I guarantee you will too. From my time in Gitsies, I've learned some things that have helped me have a successful and fun year. So here are my top five words of advice for a successful Gitsies year. One, always be prepared. Make sure you know your music well, do your Gitsies 10 every day, and maybe even try for a Gitsies 20 or 30. Two, ask. Never be afraid to ask questions. If you do not know a fingering, a note, rhythm, or where you come in during the music, don't be afraid to ask your stand partner, someone in your section, or even the conductor. You might learn something new you didn't know before. Three, take advantage of every opportunity you get. 
Don't be afraid to audition for a solo and a piece of music, join chamber ensembles, showcase your poetry or art at a concert, or even entering into a competition. Every opportunity will help you grow as a person and maybe even push you out of your comfort zone. Four, get to know new people. If you're the new kid who doesn't know anyone in the orchestra, try and at least say hi to someone new at every rehearsal. If you already know people from past years or school, try and meet someone new you didn't know before. Five, have fun. As cliche as it sounds, no matter what orchestra you're in, what instrument you play, or where you're seated, if you play your part and make the best out of this experience, I promise you it'll be both fun and rewarding. I'm very excited about this upcoming year, and I hope you are too. Have a fantastic It's Easier, and I wish you all the best in your own musical and personal journeys. Thank you.